Hey guys, it's Josh. So listen, I just wanted to bring you a new report that came out of the Housing and Urban Development Corporation uh, about new home sales, which is of course new construction from home builders. And it tells us that for two months in a row, April's new home sales were up greater than expected. That that's runs right in line with what I've been seeing locally here in Utah, Salt Lake and Utah counties especially, with lots of interest from clients about construction loans and buying new homes. Now, I believe that's because a lot of the inventory that's out there, a lot of the bank-owned stuff, is just not up to par. It's been picked over and it's not as good. So, great news for new, for new construction and for home builders because it's really been a lagging sector for the last couple of years. So here's what else was buried in this report that I thought was interesting. Uh, the month's inventory nationwide now of new homes is only six and a half months. And at six months, it's considered to be in a buyer's market. So that means that our inventory has been depleted so much that home builders are going to have to start ticking up the number of units that they build this year. That's great news for our economy overall and an indicator that uh, not only locally, but nationally, new home sales are really starting to come back. Uh, now, the other thing that I thought was very interesting was the markets or the price ranges in which new home sales increased the most. So over 200,000 was up marginally. Over 300,000 was up 2,000 units from the previous months. But over 400,000, let me check my numbers, make sure I'm right. Yes, over 400,000, there were 3,000 more homes sold in April than in March. So what we're starting to see from last year, if I look back to October's numbers of last year before we went into kind of the winter slowdown, the majority of the new home sales were in that 200 to 250 range. And it looks like we're starting to build speed for the higher end homes maybe call them luxury homes, probably more accurately, move up buyers. So those are people who've been watching the market, timing things, and not coming in at your entry level homes, but selling an existing home and moving into the three, 400,000 plus range. So great underlying news story here. Uh, and, and it really backs up what I've been seeing locally of lots of information about wanting to buy new construction. Hey, if I can do anything for you on the financing side, love to help you answer any questions that you have. Happy house hunting out there, and I wish you the best. Take care.